Hello everyone, EB the original master here, and today I am going to review a movie that I recently saw yet again with a group of my friends. And before I, I go any further, I actually got this DVD a long while back, either in 2000, yeah, around 2010 is when I got this film. Today I will be reviewing the infamous, god awful, wow wow wubsies. Wubsy's big movie and boy was this film terrible in fact it's not even a film all they did was took episodes from the show and put them into into a dvd and add extra scenes that were never seen on tv and claim this as a movie don't let the colorful characters trick you into thinking this is a good film this movie even if i can call it a movie is a piece of nick Junior crap sitting in the sun. You see the sun up there? That's what the crap is doing. It's sitting in the sun of how bad this movie is. So, yeah, technically this movie has a plot. A very dumb plot. Which has been used so many freaking times already on TV. So, Wubsy, the main character of this series, was out with his friends, Widget and Walden, Widget's the tall pink rabbit, and Walden's is the, the purple bear with the glasses and the tie and the shirt. So they're out taking a stroll, Wubsy trips on a rock, falls on his head, and gets this head injury known as Knockity Freaking Noggin, aka Admesia, has total memory lost, and his friends has to bring back memories for Wubsy to remember himself again. This plot is so unoriginal, it's not even funny. I've already seen the Full House The full house finale had an episode where Michelle lost her memory. Who Bob What Pants, aka Whatever Happened to Spongebob, had an episode where Spongebob ran away from home and he had amnesia. Now when this movie has the same plot, it's not a good movie, you guys. It's not a really good movie. So the episodes that were in this movie was Puddle Muddle, an episode where Wubsy has to go take a... Has to go Get a picture taken with his friends, but keeps getting dirty from the mud. Very bad episode. Um, Perfecto party, where it's Wubsy's birthday, and and Walden has to like to make like this some some birthday lasagna or some crap. Another bad episode. Um, a tired tale, where Wubsy somehow was playing frisbee with his friends, and Wubsy's retardedness threw the frisbee up in the tree. Widget, who's supposed to be a rabbit, can't hop and grab the freaking thing. Once he tries to get it by bouncing on his tail, his tail won't work. So he has to go to the doctor's, where the doctor says that he has a tired tail. Where he has to stay home and rest it. But since Wubsy has, has bad, um, since he's hard-headed, he goes out and hangs out with his friends anyway, where he's supposed to be home resting his tail. See how dumb these episodes are? They're very dumb. They're not funny. They're, they're not funny. They don't have a good story. It's bad humor. He goes to like a bake-off, a magic show, and a kickity kickball game. That's what they're called, kickity kickballs. I don't know why they call it kickity kickball, but that's how it is in the, in the world of Wuzzleberg. Um, There's another episode called A Tale of Tales. That was the very first episode of Wild Wild Wubsy, where Wubsy's friends kept making fun of his tail. Well, not his real friends. They're his side character friends kept making fun of his tail so his two other friends his real friends tried to convince him that his tail is very special very bad pilot episodes it wasn't funny um then there's another episode where um Wubsy watched a horror film and he's afraid that that there's monsters living in his house so which is like the, the guard dog builds him like an invention and then they think that every they think all the things in Wubsy's house are monsters, so they go off to tell Walden about it. It's a bad film, you guys. It's a very bad film. It's not even rated. This movie is a piece of Nick Jr. garbage. Do not buy this movie. The reason why I got this movie because I don't know. I was I was just at Toys R Us in 2010, and I was like, oh, can I got can I buy Wild Wild Wubsy? Can I buy Wild Wild Wubsy? I'm like, why will I buy this movie? I don't even know why I got this. I'm so glad I watched this again and just roasted it because how how bad this movie is. If you even even if you even call it a movie, it's not funny. It's bad. 
So, there's another episode where they went on like a pirate adventure. Bad. They went on like a little pirate adventure. They had these turtles called Snappity Snap Turtles or some crap. I don't know why they call it Snappity Snap Turtles. Snappity Snap these nuts. This movie's bad. And so, the ending of the episode, or movie, whatever you want to call it, Wubsy trips on that same rock, and his memory comes back, and they go off to get some pie. So the pie is called Doodleberry Pie or some crap. I mean, they keep, they keep naming all these weird things. Well, I don't know why they can't call it Frisbee or pie or some garbage. Oh yeah, I forgot. There's also another episode on that DVD where they spy on Walden. Yeah, they, they were spying on him, Widget, and Wubsy decides to spy on Walden because he was like having like a surprise or some crap. It was bad. It wasn't funny. The humor was bad. The only thing that was funny is just roasting it. That's the only good thing about this whole DVD is because it's, it's, you can just roast it of how bad it is. Seriously, you got Wubsy, Widget, and Walden acting like little kids because they are little kids because in the musical number, that's what friends are for. They were playing with blocks. They were playing with blocks. That tells you right there they're not adults. They're kids. So... If I gave this movie a rating, Wubsy's big movie, if I gave this a rating, I'll give this a 3 out of 10. Very bad movie. It's not funny. This is meant for kids. That's, I think a kid will laugh at this, but for a person my age, it's not funny. What's funny about this film, of how stupid it is, don't let the giant title, Wubsy's big movie, think you that this is a movie. It's not a movie, it's a piece of filth that should have never been put on store shelves. They should have never released this movie. This movie is a pile of Nick Jr. noggin garbage. And I'm so glad that Wild Wubsy got off the air and no longer making episodes. The show only had two seasons. Two seasons. That's it. Then in 2010, they made their final episode and they never aired Wild Wubsy ever again on national television. So if you want to watch the full episodes of this god-awful show that you can roast... You can either watch it on Watch Cartoons Online, or I think it's on Kiss Cartoons, I think. But you can watch this on Watch Cartoons Online. Watch all the full episodes. In fact, I will be taking a break with SpongeBob SquarePants and review Wow Wow Wubsy episodes. and tell you guys how bad this show is. Very bad movie. Did not pick this up. This movie gets a 3 out of 10. Not funny movie. Very terrible. The plot is not original. Well, hope you guys enjoyed my review for Wubsy's Big Movie. It's not a movie, it's bad. And I guess I'll see you guys later. Oh, by the way, tomorrow, um, I'll be working on the second segment of episode 43, Meet the Squids, from SpongeBob SquarePants, the Roblox series, my original YouTube series. And I'll see you guys later. Sayonara.